morning. Here at Heritage Fine Foods, we pride ourselves on supplying seasonal produce. So, just for a minute, I'm going to talk about seasons today because in these days of global supply, that's a pallet coming in, global supply, with even with restricted air travel, something's always in season somewhere in the world. So, seasonal is often used in a context which is not necessarily seasonal in the UK, but we do like only to supply stuff if we can that's in season in the UK. So these are, I'm still in front of a few examples of how the seasons work. So let's take cauliflower. You can grow cauliflower in the UK all of the year round pretty much. It's a little bit tight at the moment as the winter crop ends and the spring crop gets going. So this angle cauliflower is the plant but that will only be with us probably for a week, 10 days, and then we'll be back on to English. Broccoli, broccoli ironically, very similar, but you cannot grow that in the UK in the winter, it just won't grow in the winter. So this is English, the very first of the English, it's not in our boxes yet, but it will be very soon. English season is, I suppose, May through to October, depending on the frost, and then in the winter it just comes from Spain. But it's in season in Spain, it's just not in season in the winter in the UK. Now, a couple of things that are in season. I mean, this is from our local grower, Mr. Hayward. This is it's a spring cabbage, one of my favorite veg, a nice dark green veg, lush green. Gets planted in the autumn, sits there all through the winter as a tiny plant, and then just grows in the spring and develops into, first of all, a leafy spring green, and then a spring cabbage. So that is in season, along with this rather magnificent Lolo Rosso, which are in the boxes this week and will give us a bit of colour. But then a good example, over there we've got, you would think, a nice box of British parsnips. Well, parsnips are an unusual crop. They, they've got one of the longest growing seasons of all. You have to plant them in February if you can, maybe March. They don't, they're not ready to harvest till August, usually the earliest. But then they just sit in the ground all winter. The frost won't affect them at all. And we have, you know, we eat parsnips from English parsnips from August through to about April, I guess, May, and then they start to put their seed head for the next year. So they get all woody in the middle. So you can't really get English parsnips of any sense in May, June because they're just too tough, and you get that stem in the middle. So these wonderful looking parsnips are from Spain. That's why they're not in the boxes, because they're in season in Spain, but they're not in season in the UK. So, and ironically, the Spanish only grow them to export to us. The Spanish don't eat parsnips, horrible in their opinion. So they just grow a big volume of parsnips to fill a two-month gap in the UK. Um, but they won't be in the boxes until they come from the UK.